My own brother, you are welcome. It's a pleasure. Sit down. Oh, well, sorry for keeping you waiting. I was hosting all the uh, aspirants uh, uh, of uh, this Zoom to give them a fatherly yes. advice. Yes. Sit down. For your support, it will be very, for me particularly, it will be very open. You have always received me as a friend. Uh, we're, all, we're all human. Sometimes I want, I want to, to compare that. Uh, my chairman is not giving to the support, he's giving to the minister. But the uh, chairman is very, is very honorable. He's very honorable. He's somebody who respects relationship. Someone who respects friendship. He knows that if you're his friend, you're his friend. You can go to sleep. You can count on him. He tells you these other things. He doesn't pretend. And that's you know, the, make, the make of a man. Tells you as it is. And from the very first day we spoke on this matter of uh, governorship and all other matters, they have told me exactly as it is. You know, so, so, I commend you for that. That's very, that's very honorable. You have not tried to deceive me, you have not tried to lie to me. And one thing that is clear is that we put a force who like ourselves. We know that. Uh, we want a better rivers to go on, the rivers to be a team to work. We want the rivers to be where we're able to send our kids to school, where we're able to take our, our sick to hospitals, where we'll have good medical okay. okay. attention, good doctors, good doctors. Okay. You know, we need, like you just mentioned, anybody who go on the rivers, they must promise that we are going to run away from this one city state into several cities. And it is very possible with all our resources. And we need, we need somebody who can also help to build, to expand our economy, to accommodate all the diagnostic things that we, we are setting out to do. So I hope that my, my, uh, my private sector experience you know, will help in that, uh, in that direction. I hope everything else, I believe that there's too much hate in our politics now. We need to bring it down. It's, uh, we need to bring it down. And the one way of doing that will be you know, to recognize that accommodation is always better than exclusion. So, whosoever wins must do that extra work, you know, to recognize everybody else. And it didn't matter, particularly with party politics, it didn't matter who supported who. Party is party. Once we are picking at the show, we must recognize the fact that we are one party and work, you know, together. So that when we form government too, it didn't matter that some people supported late. Because everybody must have you know, his own candidates. And then once the party decides who the party's candidate is, everybody will pull out that. Informing government we must recognize the fact that those differences don't matter. What's important is our own party. <coughs> and when we win the elections, you know, we must also recognize all of us are rivers people. And try to see how we can have good programs that will accommodate all rivers people. For me, I always said that we must create opportunity for everybody. So that the corresponding expectations of responsibility from all is not undeserved. Yeah. And we must care especially for those who live in the shadows of life. So with God helping us, I know very certain my heart it is clear. My pastor, Pastor David Bibi, will tell you that I know this as I know my name. I know it as I know my name that PDP shall form the next government in River State. Amen. <laughs> Every day, you know, I pray. You know, I mean, let the difference, you know, be clear. We will form the government. Let us recognize the fact that we have a lot of work to do. A lot of work to do. There should be no pretense in government. You know, we should work because we are interested in rivers, people. We are in rivers, people. We must work for every rivers man, every rivers woman, every rivers child. And even for non Indians who live in our state and are law abiding, they pay their taxes. We must make sure that our programs accommodate them you know, in a equal measure. God has been us. We'll form, we'll form the next government and the PDP will conduct the growth. And so that we can also form the necessary synergy, you know, partnership with the center. The river state will always be you know, in, main, in mainstream states. We will not be in the opposition. And even this time, too, Chairman, you know, we are not in the opposition. Those that we, we have the government who decided that you know, he would take us into 
into a position after the people that consciously walked to ensure that uh, PDB won in the state. And we got the victory for in, the, for in the first instance, even when we were not in the country. The court said that it is party. Yeah. So all of us have worked for the party, but one single individual has taken our party and all of us into the, into the opposition. We should have done all of that. Because this president is working so hard for this country. He's done so much for this country. He needs the necessary partnership that he can get. Especially from very wealthy and central states, you know, like Rivers, Bayesa, Aquaibom, and Lagos. If we have Lagos in the position, we have Rivers in the position, then it's not, uh, you can see how they can gang up and frustrate the laudable programs and objectives of the federal government, which is what they've been doing, you know. For God, you know, shall see us through and show that we get back to the state. Give the state back, you know, the PDP. They turn to the Bula the village in 2015 and then begin to work, you know, work at that synergy and position the state for groups. So, I'm happy to be here to see my chairman. In his own town, I don't know that I can't leave this this, uh, this state without coming to, to see my chairman today. We are discussed over the phone in this meeting, you know, most of everything in the phone was second year, and I come to see my chairman. I'm very happy with the reception. I came with my, with my DG, Dr. Max Oredemi, my uh, deputy DG, I have two deputy coordinators for here. Then I brought my, my woman leader and brother, my, my associate, and I came with everybody here. There is my, my media town. The only people are taking <laughs> center stage. Because they uh, were trying to find someone who would be as effective as uh, Jerry did that. So, I found a young guy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> his, his name is, is Lekia. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Yes, Lekia, Lekia Christian. <coughs> so, Chairman, yes, this is how uh, I have come to see, to see you with my team. And again, thank you so very much for this very wonderful reception. Thank you, thank you and God bless you. The other one of our position of question is secondary because I believe in one thing. I cannot make government. You cannot make government. Your letters cannot make become government. I will believe tenaciously to the word of God. Romans chapter 13 has said there is no power, no crown that be except ordained by God. Yes. Whatever thing anybody is doing, whatever manipulation we are doing, whatever yeah. thinking we are doing, if we think of oh, how power we can be challenged today, I can make a man his life. So many people have seen Kenya, they acknowledge Kenya. Yes. It's only God that bestows power, leadership, craft, and leadership. So because of my leadership, I have tried as much as I can to make sure I play that neutrality role. So many people don't know me. People who know me and know my pedigree, I know where I'm coming from, know that I'm a very simple and principled man. I don't do what we may or my, my name tomorrow. On this contest, I have several said it that I will give everybody a level playing ground. If there's anybody among the aspirants who have received support from anybody, it's wicked. He has supported me from the onset. When we are caught, so ordinarily I could have used my position to say adoption like it used to be. Leaders have done it before, and that the consequence. And many is still doing it now. How many people have taken form in APC? They're all afraid. They're waiting for adoption. Whoever the governor will adopt. It used to be the order of the day. So I could have used my personal relationship, how close we are, how the man has assisted me throughout my period of uh, OT, throughout my period of uh, court matters and everything, to say, oh, I'm going to the air that I have adopted. Heaven will not fall. Heaven will not fall. Nobody will kill me. It's my personal decision. I can come across and say, we a statement. That statement will have halted so many aspects, naturally, that the party chairman has spoken. It goes a long way to down the other people's morale and interest. But I said, no. The party will give everybody a level playing ground. That have also led to so many people from everywhere coming out to pick a phone. It was the first thing I did. People should not think that people have done lobbying.
to be returned on the just like what is done in the national today. So that is, that is not me. And I have not pretended to show my love and friendship to the Monolu drinks. I will pray for him if it is the will of God that he becomes the governor of Rifa State. And it is me, my support that is needed. Just go and sleep and know that me, I will give my support. Amen. <laughs> The only highest thing he has is his name. He should pray to God Almighty. And always remember that let the will of God be done. Most of us will expect to be this, to be that. But if it's not the will of God, no matter how we try. Yes. So many people, the histories are about Audrey, almost so Kenan. But could not enter Kenan. We were only waiting for address. Since you were deprived of being president. You have the promise to be vice president. What can we waiting for? You have to just finish and announce my running mate. But he never came. That is God for you. It's not the way men think. That's how God thinks. Everybody may be saying, oh, God, I have taken side. As of today, I didn't hide it. Among the aspirants, then, to it, some of them they are. The man who is so close to him because he also assisted this wicked. And I have told him, out of 20, he carry second. That is on, on human being. What about if God said the second will turn to first? Will I change it? No way. No. I can't change it. <laughs> so the first thing I have to show have to, you are, you are carrying along. Yeah. So that if you do not go, God say, okay, my son, give me two persons out of 20. So you should be lucky that he's among the two people that will give God. So that you do not I have not pretended, I have said it personally to him, I am also said it openly, that my support for him is personal. That doesn't mean that it's party decision. Why? Because the PDP today is thick. The young man invested, the young man fearlessly tried. And I want my when I support you, I don't pretend. I will give you advices and I will follow it on. That is that. Now that we have known what before is rumor. Now that they are picked for, we now know that these are aspirants. It is left for the party that to receive visitors. Receive aspirants, advise them, and advise any meeting at all. We now call them Zara. Before this time, we also are aware that the opposition is also using people to create problems within the party. We also investigate and looking at them. There are 20 aspirants to see like that. None of them, not all of them are coming on their own. Some of them are being supported by a position party to go and cause confusion in a party. So we are watching. But I don't look at him to one of them. I look at him as somebody who on his own have the mind to serve. Who on his own feel that if put into power, he has all the duties to change the state. Finally, I want to share to you and say that he should continue to fraternize with the party, be loyal to the party, and bear in mind that the party decision should be final. If it falls on you, to go be, if it falls on any other person, let's work together. Let nobody divide us because of interest. Let nobody divide the party because of interest. It is one person. It's not going to be the 20 of you that will uh, emerge as governor of River State. But to you, my prayer to you is that let the will of God be done for us. If it is you, no one can take it away from you. As I'm preaching for me today, that's how I also preach for you. If God says it is you. But above all, those of you who are here today, know it that the man you are calling to my place is my brother, is my friend. I will do everything when possible to protect his interests. Above all, we should not allow a meeting an age to go. All the insults you have better to my government. Yesterday, just say that. President is not his brother. Yes. No, he openly said so. Since they have this, you don't really care, you don't know him. I also want to say the President is our brother. We must protect him, we must work for him, and we will shame Namichi, the governor of River State, to say so if it's not me, I will go back. God give it power. This is my chairman who must help him to succeed. He is the father of the party of the state. He will lead all of us aright. I have absolute confidence in his chairmanship. But when he said that, my own politics, you know, does not know community. It's politics without bitterness. You know, we've we'll done elections. We know that only one person will emerge. Hundred people will, will still be office, but God will choose out of the hundred in one person. And that one person, all of us will 
begin to walk under him as a leader. When that time comes, when the party decides that it is A, will be behind A. My prayer is that that A should be more limited. That is a beautiful company. You are prepared for this course. With this man, it will be the best test for Amen. <laughs>